Sabbath Monday, and some of our flowers survived the storm, as you can see. I don't know if you can see that bee. Oh, there's the bee. So, um, the energy of today is the energy of the moon. So it's um, a very water energy. And so what better to do on a Monday than to take a very wonderful, luxurious bath. So we're going to make some bath salts. Now I've already made mine because I've already made this video, but I accidentally deleted it. So what you'll need is a clean jar. This isn't clean because this is, already has my bath salts in it. You'll need sea salt, olive oil, or jojoba oil if you'd like. The reason mine looks weird is because it is a refrigerated in between uses so it doesn't go rancid. Patchouli oil, dried rose petals, and dry milk and you just I never measure my bath salts I just do what I feel is appropriate be careful when you put olive oil or any kind of oil into your bath salts because it does make you and your tub very slippery so be careful getting in and out of the tub um, but just mix them together in the portions that you think are best. Um, I like mine to be kind of a dry paste when I do it. And I have added a stone to it to give it extra energy. And if you turn it like this, it kind of looks like a heart. This is my heart chakra healing stone. It is green and pink, and I can't remember what it's called, what kind of stone it is exactly, but I added that, but, um, I know I just said a lot of butts and ohms, sorry. Rose petals are good for female energy, and patchouli is good for male energy, so, this bath salt balances the two very well and like I said it's very nourishing to the skin and it's just a wonderful little bath salt and I made enough for today and for Saturday and the puppy wants to know what I'm doing. Hey puppy! Because I like to use it in my pre-ritual pre bath, too. And I have something to show you. I found this last night. This is my little travel book of shadows that Bat and I made together. Isn't that cute? A little spider web on the front. Because, focus. Spider's book of shadows. And then it has a book blessing. And then it starts with laws. And then the charge of the goddess. And the charge of the god. And the Wiccan graces. Four powers of the magus. The Laws of Magic. So 
other things. And then uh, correspondences, chakras. And then in the back it's got prayers. And then on the back, typical. That did the covers and the binding, and I did the inside. Don't we work well together? And I also have an announcement. Uh, tomorrow, I will be doing two videos. Um, the first one is going to be my pre Sabbath Tuesday video, and the second one is going to be a full moon project. It's going to be making moon cookies, and I'm going to be doing that one with Kitty. I hope everyone has a wonderful pre Sabbath Monday, and blessed be. Thank mm -hmm. you.